What up? Let's get to it. So the Minnesota Vikings, bottom line, need to bring back big dog Kyrus Tonga, heavy. Let's just get into some of his PFF stats. Actually, two PFF stats that I think are most important, like yearly PFF stats. How did he do the year before? How did he play the year before, didn't he? What was his numbers? Did he really help the team? So if you go take a look at Kyrus Tonga's PFF stats, last year he was ranked 52.1. This year he was 77.9. So that there shows improvement in itself right there. How much his numbers increased, didn't he? How his gameplay improved when he came to the Vikings. Shout out to Kyrus Tonga, man. He earned a spot this year, heavy, no doubt. And we know sometimes the PFF can lie. So that's why you also, most importantly, must watch the film on the field. Yeah, you must see how the guy plays, moves on the field, right? And Kyrus Tonga was solid, if you ask me. Came in, did his job. Despite it being short notice, right? Coming from Chicago, <laughs> whole different team area, etc. Adapting, adjusting, or giving more time. Like I said, this time the PFF grade didn't lie heavy. It was real deal. <laughs> Dig me? Big skull head. Let me know how you feel about it. Do you think the Minnesota Vikings should bring Kyrus Tonga back? Bring him in the building? Dig me? Do you think he earned it? Earned a spot? I think he did. <laughs> Let me know how you feel. Feedback is much appreciated, man. Heavy. But Kyrus Tonga, man, I feel like a guy who could get bigger still, get stronger. If he stays focused, puts the work in the offseason, I feel like he's a guy who can come in right away and take Dalvin Tomlinson's spot heavy. No disrespect. Not only can he replace Dalvin Tomlinson, he'll save the Vikings some guapino, dig me? <laughs> yeah. The Vikings aren't in a great spot financially, right? As far as cap space and all that, oh, they're tied up heavy. They got to make some room. What a great way to make it. I mean, Dalvin Tomlinson, he's solid, but the Vikings' run defense needs more, especially on the front line. They need a big dude, big quick dude, dig me, who won't and who will refuse not to get carried into the end zone like Dalvin Tomlinson did, dig me, in the playoff game, most important game of the year. Saquon Barkley basically carried him to the end zone heavy. So he's solid, but he's not great. He hasn't been great. The Vikings' run defense was gashed once again. So you have to look at personnel as well. Coaching, big factor, boom. Problem solved. But you have to look at players as well. And I know it's tough. Some of your favorite players may have to go transition to another team. Tough decisions. Guys who are ring of honor guys, legends in the building. It is what it is, though. This is the business at the end of the day. Heavy. Do the Vikings want to just... Be friendly and continue to lose. Be average. Hey, Wilfs, do you? Let me know. Heavy. Or do the Vikings want to win a Super Bowl one day? Reach the ultimate goal. Be the ultimate competitor. Be the best one damn day. Make history, right? So which one is it? Oh, I must know. Heavy. Big skull head. Bottom line. Man. But that's what it's about. So they can save cap space. Bring a guy in who can fill in and play. He's proved that. And go get another D tackle who's solid, solidified, like a big Deron Payne, spend some more money. If not, go to the draft. There's some solid D-tackles in there, right? Yeah, hit the draft. But this year, they can go either way, draft or free agency, heavy. So yes, Kyrus Tonga, at this point of the Vikings' new regime, would be an asset to the team, man, heavy. He still has improvements to make, no doubt. Only 26, still can learn, still can grow, get better, develop, be developed. That's where coaching comes in. Wow, ooh, let's get it heavy. That's my take, my opinion on it, man. Kyrus Tonga deserves to be back with the Vikings. Heavy. Big skull head. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Feedback is much appreciated. Takes less than one second. No excuses. Hit that notification bell so you know when I'm on. Rocking and rolling, too. Much appreciated, man. Shout out my big dogs, my subscribers, supporters. You all appreciate it for life, no doubt. Oh, man, oh, man. I ain't got no picture, hit me. Skull like that. Hey.